Hi rainbows, this is Masala, and today I'm going to teach you how to paint using coffee. So what you'll need for this is a piece of white paper, a pencil, a spoon, a paintbrush, some water, a glass or a cup, and some coffee. Now the coffee that I have today is actually instant coffee. So it's kind of already grounded up. It looks something like that. Now if you don't have instant coffee, that's totally fine. You can also use coffee beans or when your mom or your dad brews coffee, which I'm sure everybody's parents do. Um, you can use the, the, the coffee grinds that come out of the little filter. You can use that as well. Um, but this will do as well too. So what you need to do is just take one spoon or two or three, depending on how dark you want to make it, and you're going to put it into the cup. I'm going to use about two to maybe three whole spoons. I'm not going to put a lot of water because I kind of want my um, mixture to look a little bit darker, kind of like a darker paint. So this water has been a little bit heated up. Um, it's not too hot, but you can use colder water. It's just going to take a little bit longer to to dissolve. So I put about that much in the cup and I'm going to stir it up, mix it well. You can see the color of the coffee is like this nice brown. And if it's not dark enough, once you actually try to paint with it, you can add more coffee. So you can do like a little test run and see how it looks. So then you take your paintbrush and your paper, and first you want to draw a picture on your paper. And I pre-drew a picture already. I just drew some flowers. Just the flowers, some leaves. You can draw shapes, you can draw, you know, whatever you want to draw, any kind of creation, and then you can draw with it. So you're gonna take your paintbrush and you dip it into the cup with the coffee, and you will slowly paint the flower. Now see how the flower is kind of light and it's not very dark. You can go back and you can add more of the color to make it a little darker. It will be wet and that's okay and it'll dry. Keep your paper really nice and still. But if you want to make your mixture even darker, what you want to do is add another cup or another spoon I mean of the coffee grinds into your coffee mix it really well. I'll add about two more spoons actually. I stopped drinking coffee so I just have it left over. So it looks even darker. You can tell the, the consistency of it is even a little bit thicker. So after you mix that up, try again and dip your paintbrush in and then you can paint the second petal and see how that comes out even darker. Paint each petal. Some can be lighter, some can be darker. If you draw a picture, you can draw, you can color it in with the shapes, like that. Once it dries, you can go over the petals that you drew or the shape that you drew again, and you can add more color onto it just like you would do with paint. So this one I had done earlier, and once I add more to it, once it dries, it becomes even darker. See so like the little dots or the actual coffee drying because it's wet. So your turn to try to paint with coffee. Have fun!